as we emerge from a very long wet winter, I know that all of us lucky enough to call Puget Sound home are ready to get out and enjoy its magnificent wonders. But beneath its beautiful surface, there's another truth. We all know it. Puget Sound's in trouble. Notably, our southern resident orca population has dwindled to just 78. For years, despite the hard work of many, degradation still outpaces recovery. 2016 was an especially tough year as we lost seven orcas, including the iconic Granny, more than 100 years old. If our surviving orcas are to stay healthy and support future generations, they're going to need plenty of salmon to nourish their bodies. Here's the plain truth. We can't save the orcas unless we save the salmon. And we can't save the salmon unless we save Puget Sound. It's that straightforward. Now, don't get me wrong. We've made some progress, but we're not moving fast enough. We got to do more at the federal, state, and local level. Protection and recovery of the orcas requires every one of us to step up to the plate. That's why as co-founder of the Congressional Puget Sound Recovery Caucus, I'm fighting to protect federal funding to restore salmon habitat and prevent stormwater and other dirty pollutants from harming our waters. In Washington State, we've held gatherings across Puget Sound every June for over a decade to celebrate our orcas, which are, after all, icons of Northwest life. That served as a month-long reminder of work that requires a year-round focus. So as we mourn these difficult losses, we also need to roll up our sleeves and get to work with a renewed sense of both optimism and determination. Congress can help this effort by passing the resolution I'm introducing to commemorate June as National Orca Protection Month. Because in addition to protecting funding for Puget Sound recovery, we've got to call more national attention to our beloved orcas and our sound in order to restore it. With the strength of a national movement and the official designation of National Orca Protection Month, we can fight back against extinction of this beautiful species and ensure its survival for future generations.